Hello everyone, so this is Dr. Tushar Mehta and today I will be talking about this very important aspect of living life that is called as the art of introspection. Uh, you can call it self-analysis, in Hindi some people call it avalokan, there are many words given to it. Today uh, I will start with my own story. Although many of you have had the experience of the similar thing in your past, but aaj main apne se shuru karta hu. I was to I'm talking about my uh, PG Viva exam, jo main orthopedics ka Viva exam dene ke liye gaya tha, and I was done with my long case, and it was the time for my short case. Um, in short case, you are supposed to just write down the positive findings and come to the conclusion. So I came to the diagnosis, and diagnosis was not right. And the examiner told me on my face, it was less of time which was left for my short case. I think it was some 20 minutes and uh, I had already explained him everything in 14, 13, 14 minutes. And then he said, but you know what, your diagnosis is absolutely wrong. And I was on the verge of breaking down because uh, I was not very sure that I'll be able to clear it or not. But then he said one important line. He said, don't worry, I'm passing you. I'm, in fact, I'm giving you good marks for your approach. And then he said, forget the timer, forget everything, just introspect that why, despite having a correct approach, you came to the wrong conclusion. Of course, I was stuck with the exam and at that point of time, the priorities were different. My priority was just to get over with it and, you know, go back home. So next morning, I started thinking about that case and after 20-25 minutes of introspection, as we say, I came to the conclusion that yes, my approach was right, but in the end I was not able to identify certain salient features of one particular disease and I was going for the disease which is usually obviously given in the exams. And it was one of the rare things that they had kept over there. So this is what I wish to tell you people all, you know, listening to me as well, that mistake is something which we all tend to commit. We are humans. First of all, we are humans. We tend to commit mistakes. Mistakes, I would say, they are a constant source of dynamic learning. This is this is what I have always believed in my life that they are a constant source of dynamic learning. If you have to be a you know good student of life throughout, you should commit mistakes. When you commit a mistake, don't take it on your head. Please try to consider it as an achievement. But analyzing that mistake, I think that's an honor. So, mistake karna ek achhi baat hai, koi buri baat nahi hai. Lekin us mistake ke baare mein sochna, usko analyze karna, bhoat chhi baat hai. You should take it as honor, as I said previously. We all, I mean, the most successful people out there in the world, they all have admitted in their, you know, past that they have committed so many mistakes. But what is one thing that they have also said in their motivational lectures is that, you know, they worked hard on it. They realized it, they introspected, and then they made sure that next time it is not a mistake. So the lesson that we learned today here is that we have to commit mistakes. And the bigger part is that we have to learn how to improve them in the next time. There's one more thing that I would like to share here is that we have to recognize the pattern of, you know, the habit of ours that is creating mistake. I have a little bit I would, I would like to use the opportunity to tell, you know, many PG aspirants and, you know, medical students are also listening to this. But a girl thing is not a big deal. You all do it. Your seniors, your professors, we all have done it in our life. It's a big deal from that girl thing. But it's a big deal from that girl thing. But it's a big deal from that girl thing. It's a big deal from that girl thing. It's a big deal from that girl thing. एक एक हैबिट होती है मिस्टेक कमेंट करने की उस पैटर्न को अंडरस्टैंड करना बहुत जरूरी है दैट माइट बी वेस्टिंग योर टाइम ऑन सोशल मीडिया टू मच दैट माइट बी नॉट गेटिंग अप यू नो मे बी हैविंग एक्सेस स्लीप दैट दैट इज अगेन अ पैटर्न ऑफ मिस्टेक दैट माइट बी नॉट बीइंग एबल टू कंसंट्रेट ऑन व्हाटएवर यू आर डूइंग फॉर मोर देन 45 45 मिनट्स सो दैट इज अगेन अ पैटर्न यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड सी अ मिस्टेक कैन गिव यू पेन एंड इफ यू वांट टू गेन यू हैव टू लर्न फ्रॉम दैट पेन this is a very old saying. So if you have to gain, you have to learn from that pain that you suffer after you commit a mistake. And the lesson that we learn is that we have to introspect it. There's one more thing, you know, I would like to use this platform again because both looks on 
बेटा आप लोगों को एक चीज़ को ध्यान में रखना है दैट सम ऑफ द पीपल यू नो दे आर सेंडिंग मैसेजेस ऑन सोशल मीडिया दैट आई एम नॉट एबल टू फोकस यू नो दिस इज समथिंग दैट कम्स वेरी ऑफन दैट आई एम नॉट एबल टू फोकस नो वेन आई से आई एम नॉट एबल टू फोकस दैट मीन्स दैट प्रॉब्ली योर माइंड इज नॉट इन योर कंट्रोल दैट इज वट आई यू नो इन्फर आउट ऑफ इट दैट इज वट आई कैलकुलेट आउट ऑफ इट कि आपका दिमाग आपके काबू में नहीं है माइंड इज़ अ ब्यूटिफुल सर्वेंट जितना काम कराना आप करा सकते हो एंड इट इज़ अ वेरी डेंजरस मास्टर सो यू हैव टू टेम योर माइंड यू हैव टू कंट्रोल योर माइंड जब तक आप अपने दिमाग पे अपना काबू नहीं रखेंगे अपने इमोशंस पे काबू नहीं रखेंगे आप आगे नहीं जा पाएंगे सो वॉट आई एम ट्राइंग टू टेल यू विस दैट कमिटिंग अ मिस्टेक इज नॉट अ प्रॉब्लम अंडरस्टैंडिंग दैट इज़ अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग टू बिट डन एनालाइजिंग दैट इज़ अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड द पैटर्न एंड वर्क ऑन इट बाई यूजिंग अ स्ट्रॉन्ग माइंड यू हैव टू बी इमोशनली वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग इट डिफाइंस इज नॉट एक्सेप्टेबल वो नहीं चलेगा इवन पर्सनल लाइफ प्रोफेशनल लाइफ दज अ लॉन्ग लॉड ऑफ लाइफ यू नो सम पीपल यू नो माइट बी इन देर अर्ली ट्वेंटीज दे आर प्रॉबेबली इन द मोस्ट मेलेबल एंड डक्टाइल फेज ऑफ देयर लाइफ और लिसनिंग राइट नाउ यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट स्टार्ट शेपिंग अप योर माइंड बिकॉज एट द एंड ऑफ द डे दिस इज द ओनली थिंग विच इज गोइंग टू बी विद यू फॉर एवर सो वर्क ऑन दैट There's another pattern that I've been seeing for late is that you know uh, probably you're not uh, you're not accessible to what people tell you. ये भी बहुत हो रहा है आजकल that people are not you know access people are not actually acceptable acceptable to the fact that somebody is pointing out the mistake whether that can be parents that can be teachers that can be your colleagues that can be your well wishers. So there's a very old saying from this very well-known author that when you hear only what you want to hear, you're not actually listening. जब आप सुनना ही चाहते हैं और वही सुनाया जाए तो वो सुनना नहीं है. Basically, listen to what you don't want to hear too. That's how you grow. So if you want to grow, you should have a constructive criticism in your life. Now again, why I'm saying this is because many of the students who are preparing for the PG entrance exam, they are supposed to write down that exam in 2021 or whenever it happens next. You're supposed to give a monthly grant test, which includes 300 subjects, or the, which includes 300 questions from all 19 subjects. And then when you analyze that, you will get to know. See, now I'm connecting all the dots. Why I started with uh, introspection. so first of all you know give those get take up that test of 300 questions whatever you get right great but whatever you get wrong please analyze them they are your mistakes okay introspect analyze try to find out that which subject i'm scoring the least and work on it and when you will start working on it you will get to know that yes this is the pattern that i've been using to commit a mistake and then use your mind to overpower that particular situation and then listen to all those patterns again and again because if you wish to grow i i, I told you listen to what you don't want to hear if you have got maximum questions in medicine right that shouldn't make you happy but if you get maximum questions in orthopedic strong that should make you really sad very sad so you have to understand that why i you know connected all these things today that committing a mistake analyzing the mistake analyzing the pattern analyzing the entire structure of it and then using your mind to overpower it and then you know listen to the constructive criticism that you have and don't be afraid of taking up any grand test or any test of any form the more you will uh, sweat hair the less you will bleed in your final war of pg entrance so that's a, that is really important very very important so i would like to summarize the art of introspection don't be afraid of creating mistakes we all do them you should do that as well be brave to accept them and feel honored to correct them we all have a limited uh, life span on this planet and uh, probably why i'm saying this is that the date today you know um, is 29th of uh, april and today we have lost uh, one of the greatest actors of all times Mr. Irfan Khan. So, considering the fragileness and the agility of this universe, what I'm, you know, going to tell you now is that we all have a limited time. We all have an expiry date, so we have to make the best use of it. Anything can happen to anyone, but that doesn't make me any sad, and that doesn't make me any less stronger to face this. What is going on right now? And so, do you? So, are you supposed to be strong? and you are supposed to make the best of the life that you have with you 
there's an old quotation that I've been sharing for years now and somebody captured it last year when I was taking a lecture also that I'm going to make the rest of my life the best of my life. So all you wonderful people out there in your early 20s, late 20s, anybody who's listening, whatever time we have, we don't know how much is left, but whatever we have, we have to make the best out of it. So I wish you all the success, a big hug to all of you, more power, have fun as well. And yes, commit mistakes and do introspect them. Thank you.